Welcome back to Minecraft. I'm Dave, and today we're going to be building the NBA logo. This was a suggestion from a viewer, so I went ahead and tried to build it the best that I could. There are some portions in the video where there's going to be some free building to add some of the detailing at the end, so I am going to be kind of deleting some blocks and trying to place some blocks in certain parts, so try to follow the best you can. Obviously, you don't have to make it exactly the way that I make it, but I think you can follow along with what I do. So let's go ahead and get into the build. All right, for this build, we're gonna need a few different types of wool. So the first, we're gonna need blue wool. The second, we're gonna need white wool. The third, we're gonna need red wool. So, as you can see, I've already got one piece of the blue wool down to begin with. So from here, we're actually going to go ahead and throw down quite a few different blue wool here. So we're actually going to throw down a total of 16 of these blue wool, including this block here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, plus the one we already had down, so 16 blocks. Now to the right of this, we're going to go ahead and switch to our white wool. We're going to throw down one block of the white wool, followed by one block of red wool. Now, what I think we're going to do for this build, I think I'm going to go ahead and focus on uh, Jerry West's kind of silhouette, rather than go piece by piece. We'll just kind of fill in the outside boundary of the red and blue but I think we're gonna focus on just building the white area. So, go ahead and switch to your white wool. From here, we're gonna build up, starting right here on this white wool. We're gonna build up one, two, three, four, and five, let's do one more, six. So we're building up six blocks of white wool. And we're gonna go ahead and move down here to this portion. We're gonna start right here, right above this piece of blue wool, just to the left of the white. And from here, we're actually gonna build up all the way until we meet up with where we're at right there at the top. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now from here, we're actually going to go ahead and let's build up another five. One, two, three, whoops, four and five. And stop that there. Let's just take a look, see what we think here. I think that's alright. Okay, so now what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're actually going to count up from this position here. And to do this, we'll just switch to our blue wool so we can kind of have a nice placeholder. So we'll build up three blocks here. So one, two, and three. So three blocks of the blue. From here, we're gonna go ahead and start with white. So we're gonna build all the way up until we meet up again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So now that we're at this point, we're gonna go ahead and build up three blocks. One, two, and three. Okay, now let's go ahead and come back down here. Let's start from the base. We're gonna meet up with the blue where we were at here. Now from this point forward, we're gonna go ahead and build up five blocks of blue. One, two, three, four, and five. Now from this point, we're gonna go ahead and switch to the white again. And we're gonna go ahead and build up until we meet up there at the top of the white. So one, two, three, four, five and six. Now from here, we're gonna go ahead and build up another four. One, two, three, and four. Go ahead and drop back down to the bottom again. Let's go ahead and build our blue all the way up till we meet up. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now from here, we're gonna go ahead and build up Let's just do three here. So one, two, and three. Okay. Now that we've got that, we're gonna go ahead and build our white all the way up till we meet up with the top. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go ahead and build up another two, one, and two. Okay. 
So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a while here where it kind of stair steps in a single block at a time. So I think what we'll do rather than go ahead and do the blue, I think we'll just use the white from here on out. And like I said, it's gonna be single stair steps. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is we'll move in right here. And what we're going to do is we're just going to slowly move this inward. So let's go ahead and start right here, as I said. So we're gonna move up one block from here. We'll add one piece of white wool there. Now what we'll do is we'll move up here. We'll build up above this and we'll build across one and two. Go ahead and move up a block and build across one, two, and three. Move up another level, build up one, two, three, and four. Move up another level, one, two, three, four, and five. Let's go ahead and look and just make sure that we're doing all right here. Okay, let's do a couple more of these and then we'll do a double block, I believe. So let's go ahead, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Move up a level, do one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now, we're gonna go ahead and count one more over to eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, now that we're right here, what we're gonna go ahead and do is we will move in one block to the left from right here. So let's go right here. Let's build up one, two, three, and four. Now we're gonna build all the way across to meet up right here. And that was eight blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight because of where we started because we moved in one block. And then we're gonna go ahead and go back to our single stair step method that we were doing for a couple rows. So let's do that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This time we're gonna do nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and do another row here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. Now we're gonna go ahead and come back in here to the, inside, to the outside edge here on the right. Let's move in one block to the left again. And right here we're gonna build up quite a few blocks. Let's go ahead and do about six blocks up from here. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let's just double check to make sure that that looks okay. I think we should add one more actually. Let's do one more block here. So seven. Okay, from here we're gonna go ahead and build, I'm gonna build some horizontal rows now. So we're gonna move from right to left. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we're gonna go ahead and move up a level and repeat that same row all the way across until we match up. And two. Now from this point, we're gonna go ahead and move out another block. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. We're gonna go ahead and copy that for, let's say about five rows. So here's one. And when I say five rows, I mean including the first row. Three. So that's at four rows now. We're actually gonna wanna move our uh, block in one from this right side again. So we're gonna move in one here and we're just gonna match up on the left hand side. So there that is. Okay. So now what we're gonna go ahead and do is we'll build up one more block here on the right hand side. And we're going to actually move in one block from the left this time. So let's go ahead and count that out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine blocks to the left of that first block we placed. We'll go ahead and start here on the right hand side again. Let's go ahead and let's see. Let's move in one block again. So we'll start here, one block from the right. 
let's go ahead and build across one two three four five six seven and eight let's go ahead and build up one more from this point let's build across one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten so this is basically going to be the elbow of jerry west's silhouette so actually start on this side this time let's go ahead and give ourselves a nice little boundary up from here so let's build up uh, three blocks from this point one two and three let's just double check and make sure that that looks okay let's back up a little bit I think it's coming together pretty decently it's looking it's looking pretty good I'm pretty happy with it I think that we're matched up out here on this outside edge I don't know for sure let's just make sure that we are it looks like we're overhanging a teeny bit here. That's not a problem. All right. So let's go ahead and move inside now. We're going to build this across and we're going to kick out one block on the right side. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's go ahead and just build this all the way back across once and twice. So that's what we're looking like there. Now let's go ahead and move in one block from the left hand side here. One. We'll go ahead and build this up a second time, so there's two. Let's build this across. We're actually going to start his arm on the other side so let's go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and thirteen so we'll go right there to thirteen his arm is actually gonna start building down from this point Let's go ahead and come back over here to this left hand side. Let's build up another row. One, two. As you can see, we moved in one from the left and we built two blocks here going up. Let's go ahead and just continue this pattern where we build all the way across and just match up. We'll do that again. All right, so here's what we're looking like thus far. Let's go ahead and get back into it. So we're just kind of laying out our nice base structure for Jerry West silhouette. We'll go ahead and go back in and do some little kind of detailing once we finish this, but let's go ahead and get back at it and try to finish this up here. So let's go ahead and move in one from the left hand side again, right here. So we'll start right here and we'll move in one. Go ahead and build up another set of two blocks. Let's go ahead and build this all the way across like we've been doing for the previous rows. All right, so there we have that. Let's go ahead and taper in one more block from the left-hand side here. So let's start right here. Now, there's one thing that I just want to make sure that we're not going too far out here. Let's just uh, double-check this real quick. So I think one thing that we need to do here is we're going to actually probably cut this in a little bit here. Let's just take a look at this. How many blocks are on the bottom? One, two, three, four, five, and six. So I don't think that we need necessarily that many. Let's go ahead and bring this top row back. One and two. That probably is good there. So now for this row, we're going to build this across and we're going to skip this block here. So let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Let's do that like that. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and move in one, two, three blocks and put block right there. This time, we'll go ahead and build across one, two, three. Let's just take a peek. Four. We'll go ahead and stop right there. 
Now from here what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and build up one, two, three, four, and let's go ahead and do one more, five. I think that'll be alright. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and build this across right here. We'll do one more row of this, one, two, three, and four. Let's go ahead and switch to five now. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go ahead and copy that. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go ahead and do it one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Let's just check what we're looking like right now. Let's do one more. Yeah, let's go ahead and do one more row of that. One, two, three, four, and five. Now let's move in one block. One, two, three, four, five. Let's move in another block. One, two, and three. So that'll be the top. Okay. So now, actually, I think we might want to cut this out a little bit more right here. Let's go ahead and add one block. So let's start. As you can see, we're here at the bottom. Let's go ahead and move up one, and we'll just add one more row here to the outside of this. All right, I think that that's... Let's go ahead and build one up here, and let's move that out one more block right there. Okay. Like I said, we're going to have to go ahead and go back in and do some of the detailing once we get it finished. All right, so now what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna start working on the arm and the basketball. So let's go ahead and start out here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna drop down one, two blocks. We're gonna build out another row right here. Now we're gonna build this down one, two, three, four. Let's go ahead and do, let's see. That's good right there, but let's build it down another Three. And three. So there we have that, like that. Now what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna match that with this piece right here. So let's build down one, two. Let's leave it like that right now. Okay, perfect. Let's go ahead and move up here. Maybe we'll start up. Go ahead and start up a little bit higher. All right, let's go ahead and count down here. Let's go one, two, three, four. Let's start right here on the three. So one, two, and three. We'll start right here. And then we're just gonna build this down. One, two, three, four, five. Let's build it down another couple, just like that. So we'll build down two below that. Go ahead and move up again. And let's count down from the top. Let's go one, two, three, four. Let's start right here. So five down. On the fifth block, go ahead and build a row. We're gonna count this down one, two, and three. I think right here what we'll do is we'll stop it there. Because I think that's looking okay. We might want to add one block up above that that we just added. Let's go ahead and do that right now. We'll just put one block directly above this. I'm just trying to make this thing look decent. So we have a nice little template that we can do a little bit of detailing on. Okay, so this is what we're looking like right now. We're going to go ahead and build this arm down one more branch out here. So let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna count down from here, one, two, and on the third block, we're gonna go ahead and build one. Let's build down here. Let's go down another couple here. Now to match that, we're gonna count down two from right there. All right, so here's what we look like. Let's go ahead and get to work on the basketball now. So for the basketball, we need to make a circular design. So I think we're gonna start out with an edge of three here. So one, two, and three. So we started from the outside and counted inward so we had three. 
Now for the next row, let's go ahead and let's duplicate that row that we just did and let's add one to the left and one to the right. Now, let's go ahead and another duplicated row here. I'm just trying to make sure that we don't exactly touch. And let's go ahead and add one to the left, one to the right again. Now I think what we need to do here is go ahead and drop this down a couple so that it's like that. Let's go ahead and duplicate it now. Let's move it all the way to the outside here. Let's count this row back again. Move in one from the left. Keep an extra block on the right, so that was five. Move in one from the left and build across, and that's three. So now, what I think we need to do is add a little bit of detailing to actually make it look more like the actual logo. And to do that, there's a couple things that I want to do. The first thing I want to do is move inside this armpit area. We're actually going to stair step it in one. So here on this left hand side, go ahead and add a block. I think that'll make it look a little bit better. Make it look like the jersey's kind of there and it's kind of moving up into his arm. Now for this elbow over here, I think what we need to do is we're going to go ahead drop down one block from the outside edge here we're gonna add a block here and here and I think that'll look perfect now for the head we need to go ahead and add an ear to this side so let's go ahead and move in from this left hand side let's build one block here followed by another block below it so on the top left we're gonna go ahead and add a block right here and one up on the row above so that it has a stair step. All right, now we're gonna focus on this right hand side of the head. And I think what I wanna do is completely knock out this whole row right here on the far right, because I think it looks a bit ridiculous. Now what I think I'm gonna do is, as you can see, we have this block right here, this stair step in. I think I wanna knock that one out and then go ahead. And let's just see what we want. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and knock out one extra block right there. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to stair step this out right here. So what we're going to do is you can see I knocked that one out, we're going to keep that there, we're going to build up a block right there. Now we're going to add an ear to this side, so let's go ahead and do it right there and right there. and then. Just trying to think of a way that it'll actually look decent. I don't think that's what we want. Let's go ahead and knock that one out. I think the best thing to do here might be just to knock that out up top. And we'll just go with it like that. I think that's about as good as we're going to get. That's about as close as we're going to get with the ears on the actual logo. I think it's okay. Now the next thing I want to do is I want to focus on the shorts because I think that that doesn't, you can't really tell where his shorts are currently. And I think to make that happen, what we're going to have to do here is do a little bit of adding to this portion about right. I mean, this isn't completely to scale. It's one of the only things. The shorts would be about right here-ish because it looks like it's about in the basketballs where his shorts are gonna be. So I think to make that happen, what I'm gonna have to do is go ahead and add some blocks out here. So let's go ahead and drop this down one, two. So that's our first single stair step in from the outside. So we had one, two, it would be the third row from the outside. So we just dropped it down two blocks. Let's go ahead and drop this down one. Check and see if that looks more like shorts. Okay, now I think that that's a little bit better. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and just single stair step into the shorts there. So we'll add one block here in this little nook. And I think that's gonna look a little bit better. It's gonna look a little bit more like the shorts. Yeah, I mean, that's about as good as we're gonna get, I think, since we're working with squares. Okay, now, 
I was trying to think if we want to do... There's kind of another spot right up here where you can see the top of his short. I think we might do that. Add that there. Make that look like that. Alright, that's good. We'll go ahead and leave that there. We'll add two blocks there so we have a nice area where the basketball kind of is, you know, we can actually get a nice red set of blocks right there in between his arm and his shorts and all that kind of stuff. So now, the next thing I kind of want to do is I want to move down here and actually make this look more like his shoes. So to do that, what we're going to do is over here above this red block, we're going to start right here. We're going to move one block out and we're just going to build up one, two, three blocks is what we're going to do. There. We're going to go ahead and move over another set and we'll just do... Actually, you know what? That's probably good. decent. Okay. So now what we're going to go ahead and have to do is we're going to add one blue block on the left-hand side. And we're going to add one red block to this side. And what we're going to go ahead and do to make it look like the oval shape that it is, is we're going to go ahead and build out one, two on the next row up. We're going to move up another row and go one, two, and three. Now, this isn't exactly going to be right because that basketball is not out far enough because it should be on the outside edge of the structure. Let's go ahead and build this up all the way. We might have to adjust our basketball a little bit because that should be touching. Okay, so we're going to make some adjustments to our basketball now because the outside edge of it should be hitting this portion right here. So let's go ahead and add one block there, one block there, two, three, one block here, one block there. Just make sure that we're still spherical. It's still looking okay. Now up here on the top of his head, we'll go ahead and leave this portion, the very top of the image here. So we'll knock this over a little bit and we're going to have to do that stair step down like we had. So just get it up to where it's close enough that we can make it look like that at the very top. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and fill in this right hand side with red and I'm going to go ahead and speed this up so that you don't have to, you know, you don't really need to watch it. All I'm doing is filling in all the empty space. Alright, that's looking real nice. Okay, let's go ahead and move in now. We're going to go ahead and focus on the blue portion. So, over here on this edge, we're going to build up one on the left-hand side and build out one. Move up another level, build up one, and build out one. Let's go ahead and take this all the way up for a while. As you can see, we touched here. I think that's okay. I mean, we've got a kind of a shift a little bit. One thing that you could potentially do is think about shifting it over. As you can see in the real image, the basketball should be touching the outside right edge and the elbow should be one block of blue in kind of, but it's not really a huge deal. But what I'm gonna go ahead and do to match that is I'm just gonna go ahead and build this all out one, just like this. So this way our elbow is not touching that left end. Okay, so now that we're up here at the top, again the top of his head is going to hit the outside edge of the logo, and we're going to have to go ahead and stair step it right there just like this, so that we have a nice stair step here on the outside. So we move out one block at a time and down. Okay, that's what's going to make it look like a nice oval. We can go ahead and fill in this top portion, so I'm going to speed that up for you. I think 
what we might do is actually just knock out that outside row of red. That way our image matches nicely. I think that's what we'll do. So we're going to go ahead and knock this out. Just because it's kind of bugging me that it's not exactly right. So I'm knocking out this outside right edge that we did. And then we're going to have to go ahead, knock that block in and knock that block out. So we have a stair step there. We're gonna do the same thing on the top. We're gonna have to knock out. Now that we're at the top, we're gonna have to do the same thing. We're gonna knock out this one and that one. And that way we're matching up. Okay, now the basketball's on the outside edge, so I'm liking that a lot better. All right, so now, go ahead and switch to your blue wool. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna have to build up quite a ways. Let's go ahead and build up. Let's give ourselves a nice little. Let's go ahead and build up one, two, three. I think that should be good. Yeah, three blocks. We'll go from there. So let's go ahead and fill this in all the way over here to this edge. Because what we're doing is we're gonna make the actual you know, letters NBA on the inside of the logo here in white wool. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and put in the letters NBA. So we're going to start here on this left hand side and we're going to build up one, two, three, four, and let's do five. I think that'll probably be enough. Okay, so now let's count down one from the top. Let's build here. Let's build down two. Go ahead and connect right here on that second block down. Build down one. And let's go ahead and build up our five over here. So there's five. Skip one block. Start right here. One, two, three, four, and five. Now build over one, two. Do the same here. One, two. Let's go ahead and build one, two, three in the middle. Build down one and up one. So that's our B. Go ahead and skip this block. Start right here. One, two, three. And let's do one more. Four. Now go ahead and skip one, two, one, two, three, four is what we're going to build up there. We'll go ahead and connect right here. And then we're going to have to build in one there. Build up and knock it out. And there you go. So there's NBA. It's not exactly the best letters, but it's as good as we could do with the size that we have right here. Let's go ahead and switch to our blue wool. We're gonna fill in everything that's left, and that'll be it. So this is the finished product of the NBA logo. I think it turned out pretty nice. Sorry about some of the free building that I had to do in the build. I didn't practice it, but uh, you know I wanted it to look as close to the actual logo as possible. So I had to do some free building. Hopefully you guys can follow some of that free building. Definitely try to build it. I think it turned out great. It's definitely a good looking build. It'll fit a map really nicely if you're building a lot of sports pixel art. So I'm definitely happy that somebody wanted this build to be done and suggested it. So like I said, try it out. As always, it's been a pleasure. Remember to like and subscribe and definitely take care.